Hey guys, in this video, I want to show you how you can deactivate the automatic language AI in YouTube. The last couple of days I uploaded to my YouTube channel and I got comments from people that were saying like, Daniel, the content is good, but the voice sucks. And I was actually doing my own recordings and I did not understand what is happening. And those people automatically got an AI voice translating that into their language. This is a new feature from YouTube. And in this video today, I want to show you first the good news, we as the creators, we can deactivate this in our YouTube studio because, and that's the bad news, by default, that dubbing setting is activated. So in this video, I want to show you how you can change that for the future. And the second part, you can also delete the already existing dubbings. So how this works is currently when you upload a video and the automatic dubbing is activated, it will create the, the voiceovers in the other language for that dubbing. And then someone is logging in in YouTube with their app in that language. They will automatically see the new language. But for a very important video where you don't want that, they, they don't even understand that they can change that. So let me show you what I mean. Okay, so I'm here in the YouTube studio app. I will show you now what I mean here with this video. This is actually my second video that I uploaded just to show the people that I actually speak that myself. And so when you come in here, you have to be on the laptop, doesn't work on the app. Then here on the left side, you will see languages. And here under languages, you see all the different languages that automatically were created for the subtitles and even the dubbing. So for example, if I come in here for German, and now I see here the German. The German has a dubbing here on the left side. And when I want to hear how this actually hears, like the German, how they hear it, this is how they hear it. Ich möchte, dass ihr euch diesen Film im Kopf vorstellt. Den Film von dem... So on the original language is actually this one here. ...is dreamed of making. The one that captures your unique voice. So, and how to delete this if this was now automatically created. You see the dubbing here. And you can click here on the three dots and then just say delete. The problem now is if you have this as a default, you have now, if you want to delete this for every language, you see now all of these languages it created, I have to go in and delete this each by individual language. So the good one, let's come back here. This new feature only works for videos uploaded in since the feature was rolled out here. Auto dubbing is now available on your channel. The audio on new videos will be automatically translated into other languages to make your content more accessible. You can always adjust your settings. So and here I can, for example, manage your settings. Dismiss. Uh, I don't see an information. Do I see the information here? No, I don't see when this was uh, created. I think it's like maybe a week or two weeks. So anyway, if you come here to the settings, and then here under settings, you find the upload defaults and under upload defaults, you can go here to the advanced settings. And when you scroll down, I already deactivated this automatic setting is now set. If you don't like it, like me, for example, I have a German channel for my German stuff and I have an English channel for my English stuff. And some people want to hear my original language because the way YouTube works is if your YouTube app is, for example, in French, it will automatically take the French dubbing. If your YouTube app is in German, it will automatically take the German dubbing. And as you could hear in my example, it just sucks. So what I will do for my YouTube channel, because I don't like this setting, I will turn this off and then say save. And now it will not create any automatic dubbings for the future. But for all the videos that I now already uploaded, like these ones, these ones, this is now a setting that is already there. So if you want to delete it, you have to come in here and then come here to the language. And then here you see all the different languages that it created, like that one, like the French. <laughs> Let's listen to that one as well. So the French dubbing, how does this one sound? Celui qui capture votre voix unique, votre vision du monde. Ce film, cette histoire est à votre portée. So just one more thought for the end of the video. I'm not a person that is against progress. It's actually very cool that the idea is there that you don't have to to um, dub your own videos anymore, that in the future an AI could take this over. But I think we are currently on the moment, like for example, the German dubbing, it is so bad and it, it destroys my video. I get comments from people telling me, oh, that video would be better if you would dub it and not AI. They think I created that and that's not good. I, I really, I, I don't think it's good. And also in my personal opinion, I dub my stuff because I'm German native speaker. 
like I don't dub, I create the videos in German and I create the videos in English because I'm multi-language, I can speak both languages. So I don't want that an AI is taking this over, but this is the future. Luckily, we can turn this off. Let me know what you think in the comments. Is it affecting your YouTube channel as well? Is it affecting you as a viewer? And yeah, that <laughs> I can't tell you more. You can hear that I'm a bit sick, it's Christmas right now, but this was so important for, for me to bring the message out. This is how you can delete it, and this is how you can change it in your YouTube um, yeah, anyway, I'm Daniel on this channel. It's all about DaVinci Resolve on the iPad and filmmaking. Anyway, I'm Daniel. I wish you a nice Christmas and a new year. See you in the next video. Bye.